it takes courage to be exceptional. It takes courage to be wise. It takes courage to be rich. It takes courage to be educated. It takes courage to be knowledgeable. Because the moment you do, but you, you don't talk like, oh, you don't got, forgot where you came from. Look at you, talk to It takes courage. And I'm just wondering, in this weak, watered-down, mediocre society that we live in today, in this reality TV world we live in today, I'm wondering if there's anybody left that's got the courage to say, after all I've been through, and all my ancestors have been through, and all my parents have been through, I didn't come through all of that just to fit in with normalcy. I have the courage to go after my dream. Is there a woman left in this entire Colosseum that's got some courage? You say you want this one? You sure you want it? All right. If I bend it like this, you still want it? Bend it like this again. You want it? Girl, you still want that? Girl, all right, so you... You still want it? Because it never lost its value. You got it, go ahead. You've been beaten, you've been bruised, you've been twisted, you've been thrown down time after time, but you still got value. Just because you took a hit don't mean you lost value. You're still amazing. You're still fearfully and wonderfully made. You still got power. Tell somebody I never lost value. This dude can't score no points. And he won five championships. And Michael Jordan recruited him. And Scottie Pippen didn't want him. Scottie Pippen was like, do not bring that crazy dude here. Michael Jordan told Phil Jackson, can you manage him? He said, I can. Good. We need the 20 rebounds. And guess what happened when they did that? This dude didn't start playing basketball until he was 21, 22 years old. This dude couldn't score a basket from, the, from 12 feet, 18 feet, if his life counted on it. But guess what he could do? He could rebound like nobody. He goes down as the, the most valuable rebounder ever to the game. And guess what he did for Michael Jordan? He helped Michael Jordan win three championships. He added value, couldn't make a point, but he could get rebounds. What do you do? I was teaching a, a course on leadership in India and I, I, I got back to the, to the, to the uh, to the hotel, I realized I didn't have my wallet. And so I called the hotel and I said, can you please bring the car back, they have my wallet. And they said, I'm sorry sir, we don't have a car. That was a taxi. Two in the morning they called and said, he answered his phone, his phone was off. He's coming back to your hotel with your wallet. So I get dressed and I run down and I, and I ask the man, well, how, and I get my wallet and everything is in my wallet, everything. My passport, my money, my credit cards is all there and I reach into my wallet and there's $70 US. I asked the man through a translator, what do you make a month? He says about 2,500 rupees. Which are, so I reach out and I say, let me give this $70 to you. This is my way of saying thank you. And the man says, no, I didn't bring you your wallet because I wanted a reward. I brought you your wallet because it's your wallet. So I said to the man, what can I do to be thankful to you? What can I do to say thank you? He said, well, the next time you're in India, come to my